Hi guys, it's Magpie here. I don't have Natalie here today, but uh, it's Thanksgiving, so happy Thanksgiving. Uh, and I'm doing a following a Bob Ross tutorial. Um, I already started this one by doing the piece of masking tape down the middle and doing a coat of liquid white. I just used white paint. Yeah, fun. So I'm going to start the video. Hi, welcome back. I'm glad you joined me today because today we're going to do a fantastic little seascape and I think you'll like that. Let me tell you what I've already done up here. Oh, it's called Ways of I have my standard old canvas up here and I've covered the top of it with just liquid white, just like we'd normally do. Then I have a piece of masking tape and this is slightly above the center, slightly above center. Yeah. And then the bottom of this I've covered with liquid clear. Oh, and I just have a thin, clear, so even I coat. Mm -hmm. I'll tell you what, let's have them run all the... I did try to film one of these videos the other day when painting. I have it right here. Uh, this one. Not sure if you can see it. But this one. And then I lost the footage. So you guys didn't get to see me paint that. I'll actually show you at the end all the paintings I've painted so far. Because I started painting them, and I couldn't stop painting them. So the colors I need so far are titanium white and blue. So, oh yeah, I got these, all of this, which all these materials were only like $32 at AC Moore. Not including this, I've had that for a while. Um, okay, so. Sorry, I used all my original white. Uh, by trying to open it and then forgetting there was like a little tin foil seal on it and then might have possibly accidentally pouring it like all into my face it like exploded in my face if I had footage of that I would put it in the beginning of this video but I don't we're having fun here right dad Man. what are you doing I gotta run out to the store to get a few things Will you get me gum? Don't forget it this time. Yeah, I'm in my garage. My dad can hear me. Okay, next color. Okay, so I have all the colors now. And it only took me a minute and 13 seconds to find out what they were. So, here we are. I have all the colors on my palette. And one color on a paper towel. Because I'm cheap. The brushes you will need for... <coughs> there it went. Kidding. Uh, you need a two-inch brush. Mine is stained from painting. A fan brush. A fan brush. Dusty? Excuse me? <laughs> <gasps> okay, a fan brush, a one inch brush, and where's my three inch? Oh shit. <laughs> it's so cold in here that I thought my water was going to freeze overnight. Because <laughs> I've had water since yesterday, don't judge. I'm just cleaning off my brush. Oh, shouldn't do that. Oh, 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 oh. Just, just. And you'll need a three inch brush. See, you know how I can tell three inches? I can take my two inch brush and my one inch brush and they both fit on it. So it's three inches. See, two plus one equals three dummies. So if you ever lose your three inch brush, just take your one inch and your two inch and just paint with them at the same time. And yes, my hair is up today. Don't judge. Uh, also, a stiff ass small brush. I don't even know where I got that. I just have it. You might want a pencil to just draw your outline and you will need a knife. I have 
by chance, the exact knife he does. And I suck at using it. Like, suck at using it. I can't even. My legs are so cold. Hold on. I need to stand up. Okay, there we go. I'm so cold. It's so cold today. Oh, my gosh. I'll show you one of the paintings I did. Sure, fun. I, I showed you one earlier, but this one is pretty. Who is she? Oh. Ooh, uh, I'm posting a gallery show today in my garage. So if you guys want to come on down, come on down. I'm kidding. I'm not telling you guys where I live. Okay, let's start. Oh, shoot. The sound. Today because they were going to do a fantastic little seascape, and I think you'll like that. Let me tell you what I've already done up here. I have my. It was this one, okay. What color? Okay, that's Thalo Blue. <laughs> Wait, no, I had Thalo Blue. I had Thalo Blue. What other blue did I use? Oh, because I also used this for the other blue. Duh. Okay, so I'm taking a little bit of the Thalo Blue. Okay. Amount. So just a tiny bit. Okay, let's just go up in here and let's just drop us in a happy little sky. Just a quick little sky. Just a quick little sky. Okay, my hands are already covered in paint. So I'm, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not do it like, like this. <laughs> I need to hold it to do it. Yes, yes. Fun. Okay. Weird. Okay. I'm turning it away from you guys so you can't see it. I'm kidding. I just can't paint facing that way. Artistic. Yeah. One can of it might last you for years and years and years. There we go. I have a big old cloud up in the sky. So we'll just leave a spot open for it. Okay, so his is like a lot lighter and a lot not dark than mine. My class a little bit but that has but that's whatever. Yes, bent. Okay, let me just blend that out a little. About like so. Now. Same old brush. I'll take some more thalo blue, reach up here and grab a touch of the lizard and crimson. So we have thalo blue and lizard and crimson. And just mix it on the brush. I'm just looking for sort of a lavender color. 
maybe in our sky today there's a big old cloud just use a corner of the brush see just just tap you in the, the back of the cloud here putting in some shadow He's done two things and his already looks amazing. Actually, I like her. I got white paint all over my hand. And this isn't working and I'm sad. <laughs> oh, the inspiration of this video was Jenna Mobles. So Jenna, if you're out there, I love you. And Kermit's nasty. He is nasty. I'm desperately trying to save it. Okay, Dennis, drop them down wherever you want them. Maybe write them down. I don't know. You be the judge of where you want clouds to be. Maybe it comes right on down in here somewhere. That's all there is to it. All we're doing is putting in some dark shapes so when we put light on, it'll stand out and sparkle for you. Okay, so he said I can use a fan brush, so I'm better at making clouds using a fan brush. Yay, this looks nice. Meta fine. Looking mighty nice. And I want to fly out right here. Yay, bitch. Okay, I'm going to open the camera. Hold on. I need you guys to... Oh, you guys can't even see it. But that's what it looks like so far. The sky. Yeah, I know it's messy. That is gross me. This little bitch right here, she messy? And that light right above me makes everything so right. How about now? Oh, who is she? Now, just use. 
Okay, so now he cleans the dish off. I don't use odorless thinner because I have acrylic paints instead of oil paints because I'm messy. And the, I tried doing the video with uh, the first video with odorless thinner and it did not clean my brushes and that's why it stained everything. That's why it's messy. It's big. And now I just need to blend. Doing this. Honestly. No. Yes. Oh, look at it. Oh, is she? Oh, with that peel porn. Go watch Christine. I will link her down below. Honestly, I'm kidding, guys. You guys probably. You watch me and Natalie, you should know who Christine is. Okay, so. My stones are cute. And it's And then just like a. Super, super dark color. There we go. Something about like so. Okay. Now then, I'm going to grab another brush. Maybe there'd be a little sand over here. So I'm going to go into the Van Dyke Brown, a little dark sienna. Just mix them up a little bit on the brush. Maybe there's a little sand lives right over here in the corner. And all we're doing is just blocking in color. Add a little touch of yellow ochre to that. Little touch of yellow ochre as it gets down here. There. Just sort of let them blend together. No big deal right now. Once again, all we're doing is blocking in color. We can come back and do anything that we want to do. Okay, clean her brush. Give her a nice scrub. Okay, I'm going to this. Okay, so I need to paint this. Damn thing. And get the show comp. Yeah, clean. Hold on, I'm gonna show you guys this. Shit, did you not see me peel it off? Can't you tell I'm an artist? Artist. This doesn't look like mine. I'm hanging this one up. I love it. Just need. Don't fool me like that. Okay, sisters. And beat the devil out of it. Okay, now we can start playing back here. Grab a fan brush, go into a little bit of white, and we can make our first big decision. Looking for some waves back here in the background. There's one. Just straight white, that's all it is. There's another one that lives right back in here. Just straight white. A little bit of white right along this major one. Now, all we want to do is gently blend this back. Allow it to pick up that color, this back here. Just blend it back. Okay, grab the next one and blend him back. Wipe all the excess paint off your brush and just use the paint that you have on the canvas and blend back. See what happened? Okay, I watched the ending of this video and he takes his um, two inch brush. 
drop that off. Take he takes his state he takes his well my aquamarine blue his red color his crimson his black color yeah I've got green on my hand his green actually finally and takes it since this video is going to be like three hours long this is like a three hour long video it's fun and he takes it and he just draws in that deep colored way if you're following along to me doing this at home sister it looks nasty compared to his but sister um i tried If you want to do this, just, just follow Bob and actually watch the video and learn. Well, I didn't watch the video, excuse myself. Um, I just suck at painting. Yes, queen. So they... So, finally finished, and it's not amazing, but it's something, so comment down below if I should do one of these with uh, Natalie, and thanks for watching, Keynes. Bye. <laughs>